Today is it uh, June 13, 2020, and I am going to do something on my, on my way to a recording for you. Do you hear this sound? I have taken a shower. And uh, I try to brush, brush it out. I have a brush. It's a, it's a strange thing that should be more uh, harmless for the hair. But, uh, uh, my hair is Nordic hair. Do you have Nordic hair? It's very, very tiny. It is weak hair. And it's be like a big hair bone. And I had it. I had it for some days, this bone. Because I couldn't, I couldn't, uh, brush it out so I had like a ponytail but it was not a ponytail because it was this uh, knot 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 uh, in my hair like a ball and I let it be like that and now I in my shower I took a, a new balsam balsam in the hair and hoped it should take it out but it doesn't do that uh, it was not good for my hair uh, I uh, and uh, I tried to brush it out anyway when I recording this uh, but I think I need to stop because I can't think to when I brush the hair and then talking. So I, I will try to wet the hair again with balsam and try that it's working to calm calm uh, I can't ha have a camp because uh, it's too thin the hair um, but uh, I want it was not about my hair I wanted to talk about um, I don't really can remember when I know I have promise you to tell you if I get any answer over this with aliens UFO uh, and uh, I don't remember what I was talking about in that time uh, but it's not uh, far away maybe two three chapter uh, and uh, I told you that I should tell you if it happens something uh, that I don't know uh, if it was a healing going on in an in the morning. It it is strange. I think uh, they are coming in the mornings. And uh, when it's about uh, God uh, or religious things, it will be in the night. It will be between two and three. But here it was, I was awake. I was on my computer at five o'clock. And then I go back to bed and fall to sleep. Uh, so it was between... 
I wake up at seven, so between five and seven it happened. So I was, I I did not see the outside of it, and, but suddenly the, it started that I was in a office, a strange office. It was very open. It was very a big space in it where it was nothing. And then it was um, like cabinets with things in it. And it was locked. It was not for to use, but it was to look at. And uh, then uh, suddenly it come men and women in to that room and the first I saw it was someone a man coming with a like a wine bottle from, and uh, I saw it was a German wine that I remember from the time when I was drinking wine I don't do that today, but I remember how they look like. So it was like it was Germany. And um, and then uh, they come with the food on the plate. And, it, uh, the, and the food on the plate looked like a, a sp- spung cake of chocolate. It was this soft cake, big s- soft cake, spong cake, is it uh, the name in uh, America? And uh, for us, it w- uh, here in Europe, we call it sugar cake, uh, and it was chocolate because it was almost black. And uh, I could see it was moving on the plate, so it was soft. And they eat it, and a a woman that have taken very much of it. uh, Now I don't know if it was a spoon cake, but it looked like that. Uh, And she ate, and, uh, and she... I was thinking that uh, why don't you ask me if I am hungry? But she was eating and and, uh, I was thinking about the time when I was homeless and people was eating in front of me without asking me if I want to have something. And that's what we do here in Sweden. We ask if they can give us something. It doesn't need to be the food they eat, but some a cup of cough, coffee and a cake like that, something, and um, <clears throat> or only if they don't ask so much, is it a glass of water? Sheep, <laughs> they ask something, and um, but she was eating, and and uh, now when I'm talking to you about it, maybe she didn't see me, uh, and uh, I was thinking, that's uh, so rude, that she na- don't ask me if I want something to eat when she eats. But that uh, I know from uh, when I was homeless. Uh, it was Thanksgiving and I live in, in a home. Uh, it was black people that uh, have done Thanksgiving food. And they uh, they come and visit uh, their uh, growing up children come 
visit their old parents where I live live with and they uh, they only eat and eat and eat and I was sitting there in the same room and I don't have any plate and then I it after maybe a half hour one of the uh, of the the daughters she asked me should not should, should she not have something to eat she asked her mother and then I got the plate but it was when she was say, telling her mother that she need to give me a plate because it was Thanksgiving day so I got some turkey and and this what pe- uh, the black people always eat whatever they eat is it is it is green and corn corn bread sometimes uh, or as it is both corn bread and corn but special these greens with uh, grease in it very much and uh, then um, uh, they had uh, yeah it's, it's gravy need to be of course it's very much grease in it and um and often they, uh, when it celebrates something, this is a banana pudding. And I am not so found in it. It's a vanilla sauce and banana. It's, it's not bananas. It is uh, cakes that smell, taste like bananas. And that's why I don't like it so much because it doesn't taste so much bananas in it. It's uh, more taste vanilla, and I have never liked vanilla taste. Um, but it is this and uh, and cranberry jam to the turkey and. Uh, but most of all, I, I think about when they say the the greens, uh, and I try to do greens, but I I was not sure what it was in it, so I don't want to eat it when I live here in Sweden. But I maybe look it up. How I didn't have the computer a computer to look at it. But uh, but uh, now I'm back to the morning. And uh, then uh, it come a man and with an empty a plate. And in his hand he had this wine bottle empty. So they were drinking something that had with German to do. I think I think it's what they showing me was not wine. What they were showing me uh, the country. And as they knew that I recognize uh, German wine because that's what I was drinking very much before for 30 years ago and and then uh, they had some picture uh, up I- in the air it was not hanging to the uh, leaning on the wall it was like in the air and it was like 
a television picture. And I and I look at one picture and the picture changed. The it was another picture coming slowly uh, and, and covering what was before. And uh, I say to that man that come with that plate and bottle, I say, this is what we have in Sweden. I say to him, uh, it's not so popular, but there is that uh, you can <coughs> you can place in a picture of your family and then it change to to uh, bring uh, bring some other picture in the frame you don't do that by your Self, it's a, a computer that do that uh, and open up a new picture. I say to him, but it, it maybe was um, some kind of machine he wanted to. Sh they wanted to show me by let me be in that room. Uh, and um, so what did it mean? Because it was going very, not very fast, but it was not slow either when it changed the pictures. And uh, so I say, I, uh, we, we have it also in Sweden, I, I mean some kind of those picture, but that I can have on my television today, that I, I open up a channel and let the, the picture be on, because there is channels on my television where it's only landscapes or under the water and and they don't say anything it's only picture so there he is already here uh, but then he went out from the room and come back with something special that was why i was there because he had a, a, a plate in his hand and he told me uh, to take it uh, and uh, I say uh, I, uh, I, uh, I should not take it with my hands because it be be like grease on it from my skin I said to him that it may be destroy it but but he hold the plate like over his hand so he don't really touch it and and then he say that this is not a plate like you have on earth he say this is uh, an, another sort of plate that it doesn't take grease on it. This uh, is made of, of something else that you don't have on earth, he say. And it was it was uh, dark gray between black and the light gray and uh, and then I saw when I look into that plate it was like dark blue gems or like 
it was not whole it was filled up with with some small small rocks that was gluing a little uh, so it was like you know uh, it's coming to me when I talking Now, uh, now I understand what he was giving me. He gave me a map, but it was look like it was uh, like a records, but it was not a big plate. It was about twice my hand was the plate. And what he, he was showing me, that's why I understand this, that some of it in the plate was shining and I could see it. And uh, what he gave me, it was a map. He gave me a map that I understand today. And then, um, and uh, I don't have it. It's not here with me, physical. But uh, uh, I'm wondering why did he gave me a map? And uh, what kind, what map was it on? Was it a map uh, in the universe, or was it, of course it was in the universe, but was it about our planets, how it, how it looked like, or was it a, a map over another so, solar system? that he showed me and uh, I he gave me that so I I had it in my hand so it it uh, did go into my my body it it was this kind that uh, like uh, I hold it but it like it sucks in into my body, and uh, and now I'm wondering what will happen. I have had this ca kind before, but they were those round black circle formed those plates was only. A, some millimeters big but this was a big so it was twice my hands uh, twice my hand and but they they he say it was not from earth so that kind of plate can shrinking and and go in, into the body. So, in that way, uh, but I don't think about them as evil. But, uh, but in that way, he fooled me to take the, the plate in my hand uh, because when I got that plate, I come back to my bed and wake up. And uh, so the plate was, had been taken in, into my body. And now I wonder what it will be. So it, it's going to be something. It, Maybe it was 
something that have we knowledge to do. So uh, it's very interesting. Uh, and uh, it was before, in the uh, year 2005, I got this uh, small plate. And, and it, it was cool, but I didn't uh, got it. It was shooting into my knee, my left knee. And then it come out so uh, maybe three, four years later, the plate was going out from my skin. So I, I opened it up and took the plate out, but it was in pieces, so it was not good to take a picture on it. But maybe I, I maybe have, have it. You know, I, I have done. On Facebook, I have a, a, a page where it says you will fall or God. And uh, because it's mixed of it, on that, and there I place those pictures that I took out from, from my foot. I didn't go to a doctor. I did it on my own. Uh, <laughs> no, uh, it is more that it is more like I want to see what it is more than oh it hurts. Uh, I am more curious than it hurt me to open up. I I cut up uh, with knife and try to not not hit the this. I didn't know what it was, but it was a, a black circle formed, and I knew it was from that time when I I got it in my knee one night. I go, I have talk about it, and I was up to the bathroom and uh, check out my knee what it was, and then I saw it was bleeding my knee, so I I clean it up and put a plastic uh, like a band aid uh, on it so the blood should not come into my bed. So it had been circled around my body and then it was time to go out. And then um, I'd, I have talked about one uh, night. One day it was in the... In the in that time, 2005, like this, when I have just come back from the United States. And I was on my way to fall to sleep. And then I saw in, in, inside my brain, I saw it. When I laying, it was these old computers, um, those programs that we have first. You that is old and have working with computers, you know what I'm talking about. You know this when Microsoft should show. Um, their new computer and then suddenly it uh, 
didn't work. It was it was much going on uh, that people were sending this short uh, movie when Bill Gates came and present their new computer and then it crashed. And then it was this. Uh, it's like a dark blue background. And uh, that's what I saw. And then it was a text. And the text say, it was like a, one letter came after each other, but very slow. And it says, I can't do it any more, maybe more. It was, and then it was, you know, this is a mess of letters, but not a word. It crashed. I saw it crashed. So it was in my brain, it crashed. And I was thinking, uh, no, then, if I had uh, some kind of computer in my brain, and what will it be then? But uh, just before I fall to sleep, and I was laying on my back and look up in the ceiling, and then I saw it was a circle formed. Something was coming in into my home, in the air. And the last thing I was saying to myself in the brain, they are here now. I say, and then I, I fall to sleep. So they change the computer system in the night so it uh, it worked again next day and um, so I have had that for a long time and maybe that was going on also when they when they, when I wake up in the night and uh, this energy aliens uh, had opened my skull and was working in my brain with something. Maybe they placed uh, some sort of computer things in me, but, but I maybe had it from the beginning. But uh, it started to make sense now. So now I'm wondering what the big plate that he gave me. It was not, not something I had. It was given to me of this man. I know how he looked like. He looked like a human. And that was the meaning that... Uh, he should look, they should look like human, but they maybe was not human, um, like look like uh, for real, but they gave me that illusion that it was real people. So uh, it starts, I have told you that I had these um, visions that something go, going to change now. So uh, I'm sorry that you that believe in uh, Jesus Christ as God, it's I had this, uh, the truth I had when I was eight years old. And one of the truths that I had never thinking about, but 
the truth I, I knew because I had just come to earth from God. Uh, I know that uh, Jesus, he was an alien. And um, uh, it was, his name was not, not Jesus. It was he that uh, the angel was telling Maria, Mary, that the, the, her son should be called. No, I don't remember what name it was, but it was not Jesus he was saying. He was saying something with E to do, I think. So, but it was he that it had been aliens before to Earth. And uh, and much is done in computer things before we have computers. Uh, so it's coming closer and closer to the real truth. And uh, this plate I got, I think it will show me, show me the truth. It will tell me the rest of it that we can't read from books. It's there from, from heaven. It's, it's something coming. It's not plates like Joseph Smith say that he got. This was a, a circle form, like a record. So it, or we can say it was like those first computer uh, plates. They were round, rounded circle form and they were moving around like the spawn cake. So it, I maybe will understand what they were showing me and maybe they were saying something but they didn't say so much. They were more showing me, and uh, I may be uh, next chapter. I may be uh, come uh, coming closer to what it was going on in the morning, and uh, maybe next time it will be something they have have teach me about, about with that plate. So it's interesting and I told you it took not so long time before it come. What I was telling her that I don't remember but I know I, I say something that the time will tell uh, when it will come, the answers. And uh, it started to come now. So it's very interesting. So thank you for for listening and follow me. Yeah. And God bless you. <laughs>